All right, welcome back to the channel. My name is Ronaldo Moore with PPG. And if you're new to the channel, please subscribe and hit that little notification bell so you will know when I drop these. Today's topic is simply about the 2020 NEC code change as it relates to the Kitchen Island, Kitchen Peninsula. 2017 stated that anything over 12 inches for Kitchen Island, you needed one receptacle. Anything over two feet for Kitchen Peninsula, you needed one receptacle. For 2020, they actually factored in the square feet of a Kitchen Island. So for the first nine square feet, you required one, and every 18 square feet after that, or a fraction of that, you required an additional receptacle. So let's just kind of go into how that, how that breaks down. You just simply take, when you're looking at a kitchen island here, and you just simply take the square feet of the kitchen island. Uh, we have eight by four, which is 32 square feet. So you take nine square feet from the 32 and you have 23 square feet. So for that first receptacle, which is required, for the first nine square feet, it must be within two feet of the edge of a kitchen island. So you just take the what's left over is the 23. You take the 18 square feet from that. You need another outlet. So with that, you have five square feet left over. Then you have to add another outlet because you have the five square feet left over. So for this particular kitchen island, you are required to have three receptacles. And you just factor in, you just take the square feet and you come up with your requirement for receptacles. And that is it really pretty much in a nutshell. Um, you guys got any questions or comments? As always, hit me up in the comment section. And for that one, I am done here. Hope you guys have a great day. Stay safe.